Hello, my name is Rick and welcome to another WatchCast video. In today's video, we're just going to give a brief introduction to our new SST1. In other videos, we'll go into more details about how to use them, how to turn them on, the different options that you have on a unit. But for this video, it's really just to look around the unit, talk about the different versions that we have and go through it. So let's look around the unit first of all. As you can see, it's a very flat profile, very compact. So mainly because it's very flat on top, we have a solid state polymer sensor built into the unit. As you can see, it's much smaller, much more reactive, and it doesn't give you that big bumpy profile that you have with some of the other units. Big sturdy crocodile clip on the back. So if you do want to connect it to your top, it's going to hold very sturdy. And your casing is obviously your double shot casing. So it's very durable. I can drop it. It's still working. I don't have any concerns. Now the units themselves come in either a two or three year disposable unit. These will be your standard gases, things like your O2, CO, H2S and SO2. But we do also do serviceable units, which include those standard gases and a number of other things as well, like PH3. And we also do a new hydrogen version, which comes in a low range and also now a new high range. I'll give you a few more options on there. Very small compact cases. We've tried to think about everything when we've been designing these units to give you a bit more space usage when you are stacked them up in your warehouse. Uh, see when I was on the side of the unit, you can stack them up this way. With storage in your warehouse, because it is a solid state polymer, the uh, shelf life of the unit is up to 12 months. These sensors do not leak or pop or get poisoned like some of the other sensors out there on the market, which means that if you are looking to ensure that you have a high volume of uh, stock readily available to send out to your customers without a long lead time, you have no concerns with stacking these up in a warehouse to make sure that you have all accessible for your customers straight away. So that is a brief overview of the SST1. As I said in other videos, we'll be going into a bit more detail as to the usage of it, the single use button, the connectivity with the app. But for now, that's a brief introduction. Thank you very much. Goodbye.